terminal of the same name used multiple times. This is a pretty straightforward message. It generally means that you have two or more terminals in the same terminal strip that have the same designations. So let's double click to locate this in the schematic. Double click on the terminal. Okay. Let's now, for example, synchronize selection. We have pretty big terminal strip, and it's a two-level terminal strip. I'm going to show you also something regarding uh, multiple level terminals later on. For now, in the terminal strips navigator, the first thing I will do is go to sort terminal strip and then delete sorting. So as the function says delete sorting, or you could of course sort according to numbers or page based in the end and so on. In this case I would, as I said, delete sorting and then I would number terminals, extend all of the selected terminal strips and plugs, start value and so on, and OK. So these now have another designations. So there's designation of course the number of the terminal in a terminal strip. Now let's try to check project and the X3 should now disappear. Let's do that also for the X9. You see the effect on the whole message category for all of them. X9, as I said, first delete sorting and then number terminals, all of the selected and OK. We can now just select these messages. So you tick the first box, then Ctrl C on the keyboard, you see we're here, and then select all of the other ones, the same category, Ctrl D, so you're gonna say save yourself some time, and now check only completed messages. As you can see, we saw all the messages and let's now just check at the bottom. Sometimes ePlan throws the messages, the completed messages, which we didn't solve at the bottom of the list. So in any case, all of the messages are now completed. The ones we ticked over here and this is now fine. All the terminals in this project are numbered correctly.